morning, Tuesday morning, sunrise walk. It's a little chilly out this morning. So when I opened the door, I kind of thought, go back in the house, get in your bed, girl. But don't want to miss my time with the Lord and don't want to miss taking care of Debbie. So, yes, I'm out here. And for Florida, it's a cold morning. So, get out, get your steps in, have a great day. This is your motivation to get up and get moving. We love you, and there's nothing you can do about it. Take care. Hello, hello. Hey y'all, what's going on? Getting in my second walk. Talked with you guys this morning as I did my sunrise walk. Uh. And our special guest, Mr. Willie, is here. Stop that. Stop that. But I'm just on a break right now, so we don't have much time to oh. chit chat. But hope you're doing well. Wanted to say hello. Let you know we're still on our road to recovery. I have a story, but not enough time to tell. Okay. So I have a story about yesterday morning's walk. So we will be getting back with you guys, but we hope you're having a wonderful Tuesday. Any words of wisdom? No, 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 no words of wisdom. Just keep doing just keep doing the right thing for the right reasons. But we're feeling good. Yeah. Getting it done. We'll see y'all later. Remember this? And never forget. We love, we love you, you. And there's, there's nothing, nothing you can do, do about, about it. it. Peace. Peace. Good evening. Good evening. It's been a long day. Now that I get up earlier to go walking. But got my meals done while working well, on my lunch break, I did this, actually. And I got a second walk-in with the hubby on my break. So, been very active today, but I got some spaghetti here with uh, ground turkey and some mixed vegetables. Spaghetti sauce. And I got about... 10 meals here. Yeah, 10. Ran out of vegetables, so the last one here will be a, a plus for somebody to, to have that. But all things are good. Happy Tuesday from the Lawsons. Morning. Today's Thursday. Getting a little late start. Sun is already out, but I'm getting out here. Had a rough day yesterday. I was hurting a little bit, so I took a break from walking. But that was a rough day with food, with stress, with everything. I I still ate pretty much good healthy but just a lot of food and I know it had to do with not walking not getting my exercise in and it was a stressful day at work we started a new program and all this stuff and I was doing other meetings and stuff it was just a day so I'm not gonna beat myself up about it because it's life. 
it was even tough to pray yesterday. And sometimes we have those days. So, I picked myself up this morning, picked my big girl panties on, and got back out here. And put it on the Lord and on the pavement. And we're getting it done. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day. And don't forget to pray. Well, good morning. Switching things up again. <laughs> but, um, as I mentioned to you yesterday, I was having a little, little pain in my knees from pounding that pavement. So, and I think I need to get me a, a new pair of sneakers. But, um... It was better yesterday and I walked a little bit more and so when I woke up this morning my knees were kind of stiff and achy but so I decided to um, exercise inside the house um, I'm gonna go out on my porch in a minute and do my um, devotionals and stuff that I always do and pray after walking but I did, let me turn you around and give you a glimpse of what I did this young lady. And this is the one that I work out with about every other week. But I did a, um, and her name is Kamoya Ferry. She's good. <laughs> and she's not a little skinny mini trying to tell you you know what to do and stuff. she's about my size but she she is fit and she worked out and she works out and she has a good YouTube channel and that's what I did this morning got in about 20 minutes of uh, walking with about 2,000 it, it was 2,000 steps a little over 2,000 and um, that's about what I do when I walk the neighborhood. But um, I think I need to take a little break every other day from pounding the pavement. And, um, and but still get some kind of workout in. But it was very refreshing, something different. But I feel great. Um, my knees don't hurt. They're just ripped. My legs are just sore and stiff and stuff. So I'm going to stretch out, go out on the porch, listen to the birds and watch the squirrels play around and spend some time with Jesus. And then it'll be time to get a shower and get to work. But I felt like I needed to share that with you. But um, it's important to listen to your body. You can see I got a good little sweat from her <laughs> that was good um, but um, it's important to listen to your body and that's what I'm doing this week still getting movement in but not pressuring my knees because like I said before I pushed it too far and had to have knee surgery so listen to your body have a blessed day well good morning I'm here. I just stepped outside onto my porch with my beautiful plants. <laughs> but uh, got another workout in this morning with Kamora Ferry. <sighs> Again, I'm taking a break from the pavement, but I think hubby and I are going to go to the park today during my lunch hour. And we'll take just a little stroll on the grass get that moving but my workout was good got over 2,000 and some steps <coughs> close to three feeling good had an amazing weekend gave my body a little rest uh, I did do some yard work though <laughs> but that's like therapeutic for me um, I love my yard and my plants and stuff so cleaned off my little porch here in the front and um, rejuvenated my plants 
my clients have names yes we have Lily and Polly and <laughs> Chrissy who's a Christmas cactus and then we have Velvet here who sometimes Vel Velvet just don't want to add cooperate sometimes but she's a little straggly but Chrissy over there is doing well Chrissy's going to get a new home this week because I'm going to replant her um, but great morning it's cool outside but I just couldn't get on my knees to <laughs> give, give that pain to my knees again and actually I think my little video that I do on YouTube gives me more of a workout it's it sweats me out so I'm gonna be doing that three times this week and then possibly some uh, weight training on Tuesdays and Thursday because I have a, some weights and stuff body's feeling great <sighs> still it I'm doing weight loss in a slow motion kind of way it um, I'll have a week where I'll lose three then I'll have a week where it's just sitting and another week sitting and then but it's all in the process I can tell that I'm losing inches so that's a good thing but it's time now for me to get into the word with the Lord make sure you're having a uh, some time downtime for yourself um, study the Word of God let it meditate in you I always I'm telling everybody that the meditation and the Word of God and talking to the Holy Spirit and praying for others praying for others is so important because you're sowing into somebody else and you you reap that back in if you want your body heal heal somebody else's body help somebody else's body heal by praying to the Lord for them and that's my Wagovi <laughs> and Manjaro to get this weight off because my doctor wanted me to do some shots but I'm gonna I'm gonna stick to the the natural way for right now and so far it's working thank you for watching we're a little behind on our videos but we're gonna get it out to you have a blessed day thank you hello hello hey y'all let's it's as far as it'll go there it's a beautiful what is today Tuesday Tuesday. <laughs> Tuesday and we're out with our special guest Not a special. <laughs> some of the previous videos that I taught with you guys that I was not walking as much due to my knee was kind of acting up so I've been doing getting up in the morning and doing uh, YouTube exercises and um, which way are we going okay because somebody at our seat <laughs> so that's why you haven't seen me out here and then Mr. Willie has been having a little issue with his hip. Yeah. That was bummer. Yeah, it's a little let down when you're trying to get your body back. So you just take it for what it is. But we're taking it in stride. Move on. And still out here being accountable to you guys. I'm going to try to work on a video putting up a, a vlog tonight yep. tomorrow it, it'll be up tomorrow <laughs> I'll work on it tonight it'll, it'll be up tomorrow sorry for all the noise but we're out on the main highway we didn't take the park route this time because I got to get back and try to work on some meals for the week but we're we're out here. <laughs> they say we're out here in these streets. We're out here in the streets. They say. 
Not the street. Screet. Screet. <laughs> With our hats on, protecting our skin. Yeah, that's, that's something else, you know. If you're out and about, especially, especially in Florida, really be, be cautious of the sun. Um, Black people can burn. Everybody. Everybody needs to be cautious of the sun. Uh, no matter how much melanin you think you have or, or, or your history of burning and then tanning. Everybody who has skin cancer has had a bad burn. Of, of the kind of cancers that you can avoid, skin cancer, skin cancer is one of them. It's one of the easiest so to avoid. So go ahead avoid. and avoid that. Yes. So if, it, so if it means wearing a long sleeve shirt or a hat, go ahead and do it. If you need, if you need um, sunscreen, go ahead and do that too. You need sunscreen. Yeah, just don't be dumb. <laughs> wow, it's busy out here. I guess lunchtime. Well, it is. It's always busy out here, really. Since, <laughs> since they widened this road years ago, it's been like a freeway out here. So when they widen the road, they make it flat. They make, I mean, cars, but they're usually up more cars and they go faster. Mm -hmm. so, widening roads is hardly ever the solution to bad traffic. Then you just get more bad traffic. You get a lot of them. <laughs> and, usually more, and usually more dangerous. The furs, so. There you go. They gotta be going like 80. <laughs> you wanna rest for a little? Yeah, just a little bit. We're here at the bus stop. Bus stop. Looking cool. Kinda. Aren't we cute? We're cute, but I don't know how cool it is. <laughs> But I think a few times last week I kind of overdid it on Monday and Tuesday because I walked a little bit further. I was thinking I was uh, 10 years younger when I used to walk the bridge all the way down and come back. <laughs> I used to do like two miles in the morning. Remember when me and Miss Apple would do like... <laughs> I do. A 5K in the morning. <laughs> yeah, you know, and and we and we were like 10 years younger. And there so, was and there was a time for that. And that was the time for that, but and and it is possible again, but not at the weight that I'm at. Well, it's it, it, it's not even that, really. It's it, it, it's a fitness level that has to be attained. Um, there are people who are 310, 310 pounds that. That run five miles a day, so mm -hmm. it's not that. It, it, it's the fitness level, and you know, and the wear and tear on your body after just so while. You know, I know people who are way smaller than me that have hip problems and knee problems and all that stuff, and it ain't because of weight; it's because of wear. You know, it's getting loud. I hear. Well, it's, it's the same. Line of I know. <laughs> you know, it's, you know it's, it's 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 wear it's the wear and tear. It's, it's not always it's not always the weight. It's just the wear. Like they say, it's not the years; it's the mileage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't 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 attribute everything to to, to one thing mm -hmm. or, or or the weight for sure. Uh, because um. There are people, like he said, that I see that can run marathons and do all kinds of stuff, yeah. and they weigh a lot. I mean, so, they're a lot heavier than me. Yeah. And, and like we always say, everybody's body is different. 
what might bother my body, you don't have any problems with. So, yeah. No just more, listen to your body. No more Snickers bars for me. <laughs> yeah. Snickers are delicious. Yes, they are. But. And so are Reese's. That's my favorite candy bar. Yeah, but they show up in but, inflammation in my knees and my feet. So, these knees won't take Reese's no more. No more Snickers. And that's okay. There's plenty of other stuff. We, <laughs> I've had enough Reese's in my lifetime for not to have any more. Okay. These things change after a while and you just have to really just go with it. <laughs> not, not continue the, the, the continuous fight, uh, struggle against all that stuff. Why would you do that? What kind of way is that to live? It's just, not living. Just, you know, do the best you can. Stay in as good a shape mentally, physically, spiritually as you can. And then move forward. And enjoy every day. Enjoy your life. Yeah. That's what we do. That's what I do. Okay. Right then. We made a block. We made a lap. And, uh, Got work this afternoon, and Deb's going to finish up. She'll have a, uh, a video for you uh, of, of some of the meal prep, probably. Yes. And uh, we'll get that, hopefully get that out to you tonight, that tonight, along with the vlog from last week. And just like always, never forget, we love you. And there's nothing you can do about it. Peace, y'all. Peace.